The former Lindenwood University building in Belleville has some new tenants. There's four organizations that will be moving in and bringing some money to the city. And Fox 2 is the only station at tonight's announcement. Fox 2's Zara Barker joins us now live with more on these plans. Zara. Well, the former Lindenwood University Belleville campus here behind me once had more than 1,200 students walking around, dorms full of students and even a sports team. Well, now looking around, it's kind of a ghost town, but the mayor of Belleville, Patty Gregory, announced today it's not going to stay that way for long. She announced that four organizations are going to be moving into this building behind me. It's going to be the Illinois State Police Forensic Programs, Southern Illinois Law Enforcement Commission to Enhance Education for State Law Enforcement, so Southwestern Illinois College, who's also taking over management and operations of the campus, plus the Jets Basketball Club, which will use the gym and athletic space. The city sold this property for $1 nearly 20 years ago and then bought it back last year for $3 million. The organizations are still in contract agreements, but the mayor says this will bring in at least $168,000 annually to the city of Belleville. The mayor says it's also going to bring more law enforcement presence to the area. And this is a dream come true today, Patty, that we've actually got a place to call home. And so we needed more space, and this was the perfect opportunity to make this a law enforcement training mecca in the Metro East and in the city of Belleville especially. So, so when you consider the SWIC Police Academy, SILIC, and the Illinois State Police all at one location, there's no question in my mind that the Belleville the city of Belleville Educational Center will be the largest law enforcement training organization in the entire state of Illinois. So we hope to make it a full, full campus of Forensic Training Institute, public safety, and a possibility of bringing in more of a justice center also. Now, some of these four groups will start operating right here beginning in August. The mayor says there is more room for more tenants. She also says there's plans in the works to rename this campus, but there's no timeline set for that as of yet. Live from Belleville, Zara Barker, Fox 2 News.